your voices ring cause I don't know what you came to do but I came to praise the Lord clap your hands clap your hands all ye people and let your voice 
to be better than this hallelujah because if it wasn't we wouldn't have anything to look forward to but heaven is better than this amen, amen. praise god heaven is better than this oh what joy what bliss for those streets of shining gold in the land where we'll never grow old heaven everyone just come and we're going to gather at the altar we're going to pray tonight we're going to pray tonight everyone the ushers will watch your bags you don't have to worry about your bags choir everybody we're going down we're going to pray tonight because we know it's a night of deliverance and the bible said we overcome the enemy with the words of our testimony 
Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, God. While you come into the altar, just worship the Lord. Just lift those hands and give him the glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Just give him the praise. Just give him the honor. God, you deserve it, Lord Jesus. All the glory belongs to you, Jesus. Hallelujah, God. When we were not on our mind, Jesus, you thought of us, Jesus. So we glorify your name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We give you the glory. We're going to invite Brother Kenneth Barrett and he'll be coming to do the opening prayer. Hallelujah. Let us pray. Gracious God and our Father, the Holy One of Israel, all our sins and grief to bear. What a privilege, hallelujah, to carry everything to you in prayer. We honor you, Lord God, tonight because you are good. And your mercy, Lord God, endure it forever. The scripture declaring, oh, give thanks unto the gods of all gods. For he is good, hallelujah, and his mercy endure it forever. God, we thank you, Lord God, because your mercy, Lord God, run through our lives. Because the scripture said, had not been for you on our side, we would have been swallowed up by the enemy. But because of your grace, hallelujah, we can touch you tonight. To you, Lord God, who knew no sin, Lord God, you took on sin. That we will have, oh God, right to the tree of life. Hallelujah. And we worship you tonight. We thank you, Lord God, for this Sunday night, the last Sunday night in this month, September, to remember. We thank you, gracious God, because we are alive. God being in the assembly to worship. The song said, when the saints go up to worship, that's when the king shall inhabit the praise. You are the king, Lord, and you're invited to come in. So we ask you even now, Lord God, as we gather at the altar. Jesus, we lay everything before you, Lord God. That you will open the windows of heaven and pour out an anointing on us tonight like never before. Because God, we are anticipating. We are standing, Lord God in your midst for you to bless and to do good in the name of Jesus God we ask you even now Lord God that you will light this place by fire in the name of Jesus God as we testify Lord God tonight hallelujah God we ask you that you will move through this house tonight let somebody Lord God life be changed tonight let somebody be strength tonight, Jesus. Hallelujah. Let burn be removed and you be destroyed, Lord. God, we ask you that you will tap in and you will exalt yourself tonight. We thank you for what you're doing and what you continue to do. In Jesus Christ's name we pray. Is there all the altar? of sacrifice your own does the spirit control as you go back to your seat we're going to invite you to come a little closer just come a little bit closer everybody who's at the back just come a little closer hallelujah Thank you, Jesus. Just get your bags, something, and just come a little bit closer. The end. Hallelujah is your all. Hallelujah is your all.
Hallelujah, hallelujah. You're going to invite the ushers. Everyone that come, could you take them closer? Those are sitting on the wing. Could you just come over? Just come over. We'll turn on the fans. Just come over. Thank you, Jesus. Of the Spirit controlled. Hallelujah. You can only be blessed at a peace and sweet rest as we heal in your invite Elder Bailey and he'll be coming with our night's lesson. Jesus, everybody. We're going to be reading from Psalm 95. Psalm 95. You can remain standing. Psalm 95. Have you found it? Just have 11 verses. I'm going to be reading that. I'll read while you follow. Verse 1. Oh, come, let us sing unto the Lord. Let us make a joyful noise to the rock of our salvation. Let us come before his presence with thanksgiving and make a joyful noise unto him in psalm. For the Lord is a great God Hallelujah. and a great king above all gods. For the Lord is great. Verse 3. For the Lord is a great God and a great king of all gods. In his hands are the deep places of the earth. The strength of the hills is his also. The sea is his, and he made it, and his hands formed the dry land. O oh, come, let us worship and bow down. Let us kneel before the Lord, our maker. For he is our God, and we are his people of his pasture, and the sheep of his, land, of his hand. Today, if you will hear his voice, harden not your heart, as in the provocation, and as in the day of temptation in the wilderness. When your fathers tempt me, prove me, and saw my work. Forty years long was I grieved with the, this generation, and said, it is, it is a people that do her in their heart, and they have not known my ways. Unto whom I swear in my wrath, that they should not enter into my rest. Here ended a reading of a portion of the word of God. God bless you. I woke up this morning with my mind still. Stayed on Jesus. I woke up this morning with my mind still. Stayed on Jesus. I woke up this morning with my mind still. Stayed on Jesus. Worship him. I woke up this morning with my mind still. Stayed on Jesus. I woke up this morning with my mind still. Stayed on Jesus. I woke up this morning with my mind still. Stayed on Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 The devil. The devil doesn't like give up my mind. The devil doesn't like it, but my mind still stayed on Jesus. The devil doesn't like it, but my mind still stayed on Jesus. 
Jesus. Let me take the time out to welcome everyone into the house of the Lord. Welcome to our bishop. Welcome bishop. Welcome to our ministers, musicians, just about everybody. We welcome you in the house of the Lord. We are here for a wonderful time in the house of the Lord. We are here to lift up the name of Jesus. We are here to testify. Hallelujah. We are here to overcome the enemy because the Bible said we overcome the enemy with the word of our testimony. We're going straight into our testimony service. But before we go into our testimony service, brethren, as much as possible, we're going to ask you to testify. But you know you have to cut it a little short. Cut. <laughs> Bishop said cut it. So you're not going to give us the full detail when you bed, when you get up and we are going to testify. Testify to the glory of God. Testify what happened in your life. We are depending on that testimony to build our faith. To build my faith. We need it. Everyone need it. So tonight as we start and we go into our testimony, we're just going to invite everyone. Just stand. And we're going to invite Minister Fraser and he'll be coming to do the testimony service in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord, everybody. What a good thing to be in Sunday night service. Clap your hand, clap your hand. What a good thing. It's refreshing. I'm feeling very happy. Talking about this good old way. I'm feeling very happy. Church, I'm talking about the Lord. Let's go on and on and on. Talking about the good old days. Let's go on and on and on. Talking about the Lord. Church, I am feeling very happy. Talking about the good old days. I'm feeling very happy. Talking about the Lord. Let's go on and on and on Talking Can we worship? I'm feeling 
testimony from the choir. Oh God, short, spicy to the point. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Bless the Lord and good night, everyone. I'm here tonight to testify. Sometimes the songwriters say we never get weary yet. But we are lying. We lie. We get weary. We get weary at times. And this song, I'm going to use it to testify. Hallelujah. I almost gave up. Hallelujah. I felt like I just couldn't take life anymore. Oh, the problems had me bound. Depression weighed me down. But God held me close. So I wouldn't let you go. God song tonight not because it is a song to sing but listen the words keenly sometimes you are at the edge of the cliff there are many times I go at the edge of the cliff about to give up but God grabbed me hallelujah in my marriage at one point I feel like it wasn't going to work out but God kept me. I use the word of God to keep me. The Lord said the word is a lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path. Whenever it becomes weary and whenever it comes dry and whenever it comes like it's not going to happen, I said, Lord, remember, use your, I use the word to be my feet and I use the word to be my light. Just pray my strength because Hallelujah. I mean well in the house of Hallelujah. the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. One more testimony from the choir, short and spicy. Bless the Lord, everybody. Um, about uh, six weeks ago, I got up one morning. I didn't have anything to eat. <laughs> but when I checked the cupboard, I find that I have about six fingers of green banana and one sweet potato. I said, thank you, Jesus, because some don't have nothing. And I say, I'm going to boil. I don't have anything to eat with it, you know. I boil them and I sit down and I eat. I believe the people of God have started to cry. They are for people that are hungry. Because I don't like when people are hungry because, you know, I, I just started to cry. I was starting to shed tears. Praying for those people that are hungry. And I say, thank you, Jesus. Some don't have nothing. And I had this. And believe you me, as I finish praying, my phone rang. And my daughter said, um, my son sent some money and said, I'm supposed to collect it and take you to the supermarket and buy whatever you want and give you the change. God bless you. Thank you. Mighty long way, Lord. Mighty long way. Mighty long way, Lord. Mighty long way. Oh, mighty long way.
money on this side. Hallelujah. I want it sharp and spicy, you know. Come Hallelujah. On. Thank you. Shall we bless the Lord? Shall we magnify the Lord? As I stand in here tonight, I can tell you, sir, God is my deliverer. Last year, February, I have $25,000. I supposed to go and pay $20,000 out of the $25,000, and I was going to the hairdresser. Virgin, my phone got locked down. And when it locked down there, nothing come out of it that morning. And I went up to, I was down in Jericho, and I went up to Orange Hill to look for my daughter. But she did go into work, and I go over my cousin next door, and she couldn't fix, she couldn't open the phone. And when I come, I take a taxi, and the 20,000 come out of the bag, and it drop out. And when I come down on my cousin, I, I never spend about two or three minutes down there. And Bridget, when I come back up, I find a city, 20,000. I see 5,000 to the post office, and I take up the 5,000. And when I look over, I see the other 15,000. And I take up the 20,000, and my neighbor come to me and say, Auntie, you find 20,000, and you can't give me a money out of it, but Bridget, I never knew, say, it was my 20,000. <laughs> and, and I give him five out of it. And I give the other lady five out of it. And I keep the other 10,000. And I, when we reach when we, where I'm going, that I'm gonna know, say, it's my $20,000. And when I, when I look in the bag, and I come back to Linstead, I must see my niece, I must say to you, say, you don't know what go on. Me have 20,000 and 10,000 at last out of it, I'm fine back. I have 10,000 in the bag. And she called the lady, and the lady give me back the other $5,000. And me have to put the other five. I mean, never say the money it was my money. And my brother looked at me and said to me, say, yes, I'm going to cut it short. Because I have more, more to testify about what God has done for me. Because I can tell you, say, my God is my deliverer. God is a good God. I just want to magnify the Lord. I just ask you to pray for me because my aim and my desire just to own unto God and change the night. God bless you. Somebody give God praise in the house. Now, I, I feel so good tonight that I have a testimony too, but I'm going to buffet myself. I want you tonight, if God did not allow you to get back that $20,000, God is still good. He would still be need praises here tonight. I, want, I don't want stories tonight. I want to talk about how good God has been to you. For if you didn't have money, God is still good. And if you didn't even get healing, God is still good. Find something to give God thanks for tonight. I, I know you have your stories and I know you want, want an outlet to express yourself but let's talk about Jesus tonight and how good he has been to us without even relating to a story can you do that? woke me up this morning and clothed me in my mind put joy in my spirit put a word as the preacher said this morning in my mouth and we want you to be short because tonight is testimony night everybody say testimony night those of you who have not testified for a long time, would you stand? Now be honest, you're in the house of the Lord. Mike, 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 reach the mic. Mike. Can reach. we praise the Lord, everybody? Can we bless the Lord, everybody? Tonight, I am mighty grateful because many times death came to my door, but God has spared me another time. If it had not been for the Lord on Patricia Green side, I could not have stand here today because he has kept my enemies away from me. I am grateful to Hallelujah. the Lord tonight. Hallelujah. Short and spicy. Send him some praises in the house. Hallelujah. 
Many people want great testimony, but they don't want great tests. I have been to health tests, money tests, uh, children tests, grace tests. I am still standing in Jesus' name. Lift up your hand, bow down your head. The Holy Ghost is going to shake. Church one, lift up your hand, bow down your head. The Holy Ghost is going to shake this place. Lift up your hand, bow down your head. The Holy Ghost is going to shake this place. Musician, drummer, 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 work, drummer, work. You ready? Worshippers, everybody stand. Everybody stand. We come for worship today. Joma, arise. Lift up your hand, bow down your head. The Holy Ghost is going to shake. Hey, lift up your hand, bow down your head. The Holy Ghost is going to shake. Lift up your hand, bow down your head. The Holy Ghost is going to shake this place. Holy Ghost is gonna shake this place. The Holy Ghost is on warriors. Lift up your hand, bow down your head. The Holy Ghost is gonna shake. Want you to lift up your hands, bow down your head. The Holy Ghost is gonna shake this place. The Holy Ghost is gonna shake this place. The Holy Ghost is on warriors. Lift up your hands, bow down your head. The Holy Ghost is on warriors. Lift up your hands, bow down your head. The Holy Ghost, one more. Lift up, 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 lift up your hands, bow down your head. The Holy Ghost is gonna save this. Somebody shout hallelujah. hallelujah. Somebody shout hallelujah. hallelujah. Somebody shout hallelujah. hallelujah. Short and spicy, man. Praise the Lord, everybody. Hallelujah. Tonight I stand to give God thanks because God has been good to me. When I heard that it's testimony night, I came with my story. But I'm going to tell it not in a story. Form. I just want to say that God is such a provider. You know, he has, the songwriter said, what has he done for you lately? Lately, God has just been so good to me. He has been doing things for me from uncommon places, uncommon people. The other day I said, God, I don't deserve this, but he has been so good. I, I did a surgery and, and it, um, it messed up with my hormones and I fell into anxiety and it was so bad. But you know, I prayed to God and tonight Hallelujah. I'm standing here Hallelujah. only because God is a healer. Virgin, it was so bad. I didn't feel like myself. I felt different. But when I, I, um, Sister Marsha said, I almost let go. Not because I wanted to let go, but everything in my mind was telling me to let go. I felt like this was the end. But thank God I can Hallelujah. testify tonight that God is a healer. Hallelujah. God is a deliverer. God is a keeper. And I love him tonight. Hallelujah. It's bubbling. It's bubbling, it's bubbling in my soul, oh God. Praise the Lord, praise the Lord. I am happy for tonight, oh, really happy for tonight. Because God is so good to me. The devil has set so many pits, so many traps for me. And tonight I stand to say that God is a healer. God is a provider. God stands with his people. And I can tell you, because of Jesus, why I'm here tonight. Because of his blood, why I'm here tonight. God bless you. Hallelujah. God bless you. One more. Hallelujah. Let the church praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Thank you, 
Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Tonight, I am so glad to say that Jesus saved. He keeps and he satisfies. And I am truly satisfied with Jesus. You know, it would be a tough story, but let me just go through. I can remember in the earlier stage of my life when I heard the voice say to me, makes no longer vain excuses. Jesus calls and calls you now. Come for everything is ready. We are soul. Why wait us now? And I tell you something, I learned to wait upon Jesus. Until now, I realized what he was talking about. Because my relation with God right now is not like a telephone conversation, but it is like a face-to-face -face conversation. That whatever I ask of God, immediately, is like he just said, walk through the door and you get it right there. Everything has been coming through for me. Everything has been coming through for me. It is, I am so happy. I am blessed. I am blessed. Every day of my life, I am blessed. I love Hallelujah. Jesus. I love Jesus. I love him, saints of God. This world has nothing for me to for offer for me. I wanted to pray my strength in the Lord. Hallelujah. Because I need to continue Hallelujah. with Jesus for the rest of my life. Hallelujah. Saints of God. I want to, I want to say, but I got Hallelujah. to so God bless you all. Pray for me in Jesus name. Clap your hands and give God praise. Hallelujah. Brother Stuart has lost his wife, but he has joy. Somebody said joy. I just want to thank the Lord for waking me up this morning. Without him, I wouldn't be here. So I just want to thank the Lord. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord, everybody. Amen. Praise the Lord one more time. I am so glad that Jesus saved me. Why I must say that Jesus saved me? Because I wasn't like this. I was so wretched, so undone. But thanks be to God for Jesus' love. Thank you. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Testimony, testimony. Go ahead, go ahead. Praise the Lord, everyone. I'm just glad to be here one more time. Oh, glory. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I'm being glad to be here one more time. I've left seven, eight years, September here, make eight years. So thank be to God. I can come and go. It is not easy, but giving God thanks overseas, Getting news, lost my loved one, church family, schoolmate, everyone. But I'm giving God thanks. All I'm over there, I even have a broken feet here with 16 pin on one side and a dis in the ankle. And give God thanks. I'm here today walking straight and right. Even supposed to get some money. And my daughter take an interview like it's me. She act in the present like it's me. And the lawyers say, it's fraud. And only way I can get the money, I have to testify against my daughter, say she's frauding, to get those million dollars. And I say, no, let it go. And thank be to God, I'm here today living the same way, without the money. I'm just giving God thanks another time. And I know as long as I'm supposed to get that money, I will get it in Jesus' name. I love you all in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Clap your hands and give God praise. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. My God, that money is stored up for her. We're going to have to pray and help her get that money. What do you say, church? Let's praise the Lord, everybody. Jesus. Tonight, I want to say, where would I be if Jesus didn't love me? Where would I be if he didn't care? Where would I be if he didn't sacrifice his life? So I'm so glad that he, he did it. And saints, I've been praying at night, and I'm asking the Lord for sweet sleep. And the sweet sleep has been so sweet, I can't wake in the morning. <laughs> So 
So I continue to give thanks and praise unto him for keeping me and strengthening me in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah, hallelujah. One more testimony on this side. Praise the Lord, everybody. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord, everybody. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord, everybody. Hallelujah. This evening, we were in the house, my wife and I and the kids. And we were eating dinner. Curry chicken and white rice. And I look at my wife and said, Mums, look upon this way God do. You remember when I just want to look at boardroom this way, all that we pack up, you know? I look at my wife and said, Mum, look there. A wall that, you know? I said to my wife, Mum, a deck in that, you know? I said, Mum, one TV there, there, so. One TV there, there, so. I said, Mum, one, two, three, four fans in the house are born. Who could it be? Who could it be? One bed was there. One bed was here. A big entertainment center part the two beds. And all that we pack up in the one room. And upstairs is in the process now. Who could that be but God? I turned to my wife and said, Mighty long way. Mighty long way. Look where you brought us from. A mighty long way. Praise the Lord, church. Hallelujah. The same God when Noah was. The same God when Noah was. The same God when Noah was building the ark. God never changed. God never changed. God never changed. Testimony over here. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord, everybody. I stand here tonight as a living witness to know that God is a provider. If anybody know me and my sister and my mommy, you know we're coming from a far way. And God has just been good. He has been a provider. Uh, since last year, I got this job, you know. And God has just been blessing me, you know, I can buy certain stuff and I don't have to pressure mommy for it and God has just been providing for my sister he's been there he's been our guide our keeper and you know it just feels really good and my determination is just to hold on to God 
Bless the Lord, everyone. Bless the Lord another time. Truly tonight, I should stand and give God praise, you know. Just as my sister says, God has really been opening doors for us. You know, every time when I testify for the persons who attend Friday night would know, I would always speak about college. And, you know, when I really looked back and see when I just was starting college, you know, there was no money at all. When I tell you no money, no money at all, the tuition fee was four hundred and add thousand dollars. And, you know, mommy, she could even find the first 50. <laughs> and I was like, you know, I'm not going to college and all of that. And, you know, tonight I can stand here and say I'm in my third year now. Hallelujah. And <laughs> Yes, hallelujah. I'm in my third year now and, you know, I went on the work and travel program. Even when I was going on the program, didn't have any money. And you know, this lady from out of nowhere that I don't know, she lent me 1,000 US, you know. And I had to thank her so much when I reached over, you know, and I started working, I was able to, you know, pay her back and all of those stuff. Um, when it was coming to the end of the program, you know, I didn't make as much money as I wanted to pay for the school fee, cover the rent, and all of that. And I remember one day, I was on my day off, and I, I was lying down on the bed, and I was saying, who am I going to tell mommy that I don't make enough money to cover the tuition and the rent, and you know, that was the plan. And you know, my sister, she, while I was overseas, she was always sending me scholarships, 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 and I always had text her, and I said, Renny, you stop sending me the scholarship, yeah. Oh, me, I go get time for apply. Who I go run up and down, forget the letters and stuff like that. And she was still sending me scholarships. I remember the last scholarship that she sent, it was a Will Danko scholarship. And you know, my spirit said, apply for this scholarship. Because I remember I received the Will Danko scholarship already and it was $100,000. So you know, that would go well. And I said, I'm going to apply. And I called mommy and I said, mommy, um, if I apply for this scholarship, would you go to Wildango for me? Would you go to my school and get this letter? And she was like, yes. And you know, went through the process, applied for the scholarship, didn't hear about anything, but when I came out, you know, I got a mess, I got an email. And when I looked at the email, when I was, I was saying $20,000, what am I going to do with $20,000? And mommy said, look good, a $200,000. We said, no, $200,000. And she said, look good, when I looked, $200,000, just like that. And tonight, I should surely stand and give God praise. He has really been there, and he's been an awesome. Praise the Lord. Everybody. one I have is was my husband and I cut through that in 22 there in 2022 there's my daughter until now but he kept me he carried me through he delivered me he straightened me 
Every day when I go there, I, it strengthens me more than, no matter how I'm going through, I'm fighting. I can remember a week before last Sunday where I come to church and your pastor was praying. And he said, somebody are going through something, but God got to keep me. And I can remember I cry and I stand for, I went to court and last Wednesday, where my daughter, two years now, and he just said to her, when she read and read him, he says, a good child. He said to me, said, I'm not giving her bail. I'm sending her back home for one more week. And, and, and tomorrow is Monday, and I know by God deliverance, God has let her free without of no charges or nothing. So it kept me, and I hear it's, it's strengthening me. I know that my God is real, He's a provider, He's everything to me. No matter what I'm going through, He gives me the strength to stand on that battlefield. So I know He kept me. I mean, no, my God is real. Anybody don't believe in Him. I know that he's real because it's never for him. I don't know where I would be today. I don't know where I'm in the hospital or in the models for going through it, but he kept Hallelujah. Me. I can remember when I was graduate. At first, when I hear that my daughter was coming suicide, right at my time when I graduation, and when I go there, I could never pray. But he kept me through that service. He carried me through. He gave me the strength to go on with him. And nothing got to make me let go. Nothing Hallelujah. got to make me let go. For knowing Hallelujah. Him. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name, amen. Hallelujah, hallelujah. For if you're standing on the solid rock testimony and you know the power that you got, Satan, you can't prepare. Jesus, you cannot prepare. Shot and spicy. Shall we praise the Lord, everybody? Everybody praise the Lord. You know, when I was coming to church tonight, and I was coming, and I was walking, and I said, the place looks so strange. Walking, coming, you know, because over here, you know, don't come to church on a night. So the place looks strange. And Sister Flowers came, and she picked me up. But tonight, I'm here to give God thanks for his goodness towards me. God is a provider. I said, God is a provider. Hallelujah. Some say, you don't know, like I know what the Lord has done for me. And tonight, I just want to tell you all that God is a provider. He has provided for me. And, you know, if I tell you what God has been doing for me, I mean, it, it'll blow your mind. But God has been taking care of me. I say, God has been taking care Hallelujah. of me. And I'm so glad. Hallelujah. I just want to encourage somebody tonight. I heard sister say that. She don't like this song. I never get weary yet. I never get weary praising the Lord. I never get weary praising the Lord. I get weary over anything else but not praising the Lord. I said I never get weary yet. Come on. I said I never get weary yet. I never get weary praising the Lord. I never get weary yet. Give the Lord a praise. Um, you see, when God has a purpose on your life, it, it, it doesn't matter where you are, He will pull you back to fulfill His purpose. I remember last year when I was in the hospital and I gave up. I literally was at the end and I gave up. I called everybody and said, I love them and said, This was it. And I remember my, mama, my mother said, trust God. He's in control. And I said to God, God, if I make it through this, you have a purpose for me. And I'm going to fulfill that purpose. I'm going to return to your fold and serve you and do what you want until you reveal that purpose in my life. And here, am I, here I am tonight. Trusting God and just waiting on him to reveal that which he has to, to, to fulfill in my life. Hallelujah. 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 Bless the Lord, everyone. Praise the Lord. Uh, for eight years of my young adult life, I was struggling with anxiety. I was a slave to my mind. And... On and off, I would pray. I would give it to God and take it back. Give it to God and take it back. Until I was at my breaking point. 
But I feel like I couldn't take any more. And I said, God, if you can't do it, it can't be done. And I gave it to him and I let it go. To the point where the other night I was lying down in my bed, I must say, look how God set me free. I may never realize. Peace, I may never realize. I have been set free to the point where I may never realize. No longer a slave to fear. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus is my deliverer. Jesus is my deliverer. Jesus is my deliverer. I know he delivered me. How do you know he delivered? I know. How do you know he delivered? How do you know he delivered? I know he delivered. One more time. Jesus is my deliverer. Jesus is my deliverer. Jesus is my deliverer. I know he delivered me. Oh, he delivered me. He delivered me. He delivered me. I know he delivered One more time. Jesus is my deliverer. Jesus is my deliverer. Jesus is my deliverer. I know he delivered me. This is the house of liberty. This is the house of worship. Oh! Testimony, short and spicy. Hallelujah, everybody. Hallelujah, everybody. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, everybody. Hallelujah, everybody! Hallelujah. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! I just want to say, God is just amazing, God. Even beyond where you don't know what's taking place, God has been amazing, God. I'm going to make it short and spicy. The other day, I, was, I wasn't feeling well. And, and I lie down on my bed and I fell asleep. I fell asleep, and when I fell asleep, I, I, I got a vision. Plain, plain vision, and I, I, I was like I was at a place. But it showed it, it show like in a day, and it showed you know, show like in a night. It showed like in a day. There was a man running after another one. And when he run after him, he run come down to where I am and go over one another place. And when I realized, I me start say, peace, peace. And, and the other man said, uh, he want me to run after him, said, I will catch you. Anyway, him, me see him over the next part now. So I see him with one long cutlass. So I said, where you get that cutlass so quick? And he start wheeling. And, and through me, I said, peace now. He might call me. And I go. And then I said, he said, where I go? So I draw back. 
And he might try to come over to me, but he couldn't get to come over, but he, he find and he come home. I wanted a little place. And come home, you know. And me, and me decide to say, me run, you know. And I realize uh, where I am, I could run from him. He, he would almost catch me. So, me just face, me say, you know what, I can face him. And when I face him like so, I say, in the name of Jesus, no come no further. Me say, in the name of Jesus, don't come no further. And I see him just go down and that one little place like. And me say, me will make your turn dust down yes sir. Oh. And me just, want, me just look at that and say, you know, you know, God has been protecting us. Me don't know what the dream mean, but oh. I believe our, our God who we serve, our Lord and Savior Hallelujah. Jesus Christ is a big protector. Hallelujah. 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 Go ahead. Shall we praise the Lord, everybody? Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Um, the other day when my husband died, I had a phone, um, and I was using that number for years. I was using that number. I had some people um, abroad. I didn't hear from them from a year, years. I didn't hear from them. Well, when my husband died, somehow them got that number. I was calling that number, and I didn't get it. I don't know a gentleman from Ochiraz have that number. The man gave them my real number. He said, my number just appear on his phone. And he could give them that number that they could call my real number. I don't know it happened, but I, God just worked it out for me. And I just want to give God thanks for his mercies and his grace and everything that he has done for me. I just want to give him thanks because God is... Is really a good God. Hallelujah. I, I remember I, when my husband used to use the as of my bagger when they call it. It was one thousand two hundred dollars, three hundred dollars to one. It was so hard, and God provides somebody in here to get bags seventeen all into one bag. I got bag when my husband died. I have two and a half bags leave. That is such a good God. And I just give him thanks tonight for Hallelujah. all his mercies. So. Hallelujah. Short and spicy. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Tonight I greet you all in the wonderful name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I'm so glad tonight to be in this service. One more time to lift up the name of Hallelujah. Jesus. You know, I was coming down the road and there was this Rasta man and he said, where are you going? I never see you on the street. No time I ever see you on the street. And I said, I have to go to the house of the Lord tonight. But brethren, let me tell you, God is very, very good. You know, I had a son and he did not speak to me for over here. I do him nothing. And I don't know why he did not speak to me now anything. And I prayed and I said, Lord, you know, you understand. And let me tell you, I don't know what happened, but the Lord hear my cry. The other day he called me, he said, Mom, I don't know, you know, I don't talk to you, you know, but I have something in my heart. I said, explain it. So when he got down and when he began to talk, and I said to him, I said, let me tell you, God be my witness, I know nothing about it. He said, you as a woman, don't take hold, and I know, I believe you. And Virgin, he sent some money from me, I'm telling you the truth. <laughs> this evening when I go home, he called me and he said to me, I was on the phone for my leave church from about 3 o'clock until... Five o'clock when I go to put on my clothes. And he said, Mom, where go? I said, I'm going to church. And when he explained some things to me, I just lift my hands and I said, God, only Hallelujah. you could have you, Hallelujah. only you could Hallelujah. have done this because you are a mighty God. You're a strong God and you're a God who delivers people. Thank God to deliver him that he could explain certain things to me. Hallelujah. You pray for me in Jesus' name. One more over here. Shall we praise the Lord? Praise the Lord. Short and spicy. Go ahead. Greet God one is another. a good God. Um, I want to give God thanks for his goodness and his mercy towards me. You know, if it wasn't for the blood of Jesus, I don't know where I would be today. It wasn't for the blood of Jesus. I would know where I would have been today. I find myself from the other day that I'm, I'm slipping into a depression that... I'm not smiling. I remember the days when I couldn't even smile. There would be no smile. If I walk from day to day, someone would say to me, put some smile on your face, laugh or something. And I find myself that I'm slipping back into that condition. 
And I remember go outside, I think it's pride, and I said, Lord, I don't believe I can reach there. Even if I'm going to go to the market, and if it's bus here, me get me Africa my church. Me not care how if the finance dry up, if I don't have no money, go, I'm gonna wake up two more hours before because me I come at church. Because I know what I was, I know what God take me to, and I know that this day that he kept me, and I believe that he had something in store for me. I can't sing, and I dream, I dream, I feel dreams. If God dream to me and tell me that you're going to die, you're going to die. I'm telling you that. I dream so my husband died. I saw him die. I dream see his friend mad. I want to be his friend mad. I said, Jesus, what? Almost, almost I tell him that he's going to mad. And he, when he said, tell him to plead the blood of Hallelujah. Jesus. The night I couldn't, my son come in and do something bad. And I get so upset and I went to bed and sleep. When my husband come in, he said, the guy leave. By the time I go back to Joppa sleep, it's the guy that, oh my God. And I couldn't even tell him to plead the blood because there was somebody else pleading the blood over his life. So I know that God kept me. He had dreamed the other day, see me singing. I said, God, you're really thinking Hallelujah. of me singing? That there's got to be something he had for me that he kept me. Because after that, I just Hallelujah. wish I was dead, that I wasn't here. When you're facing so many situations and conditions in your life, Hallelujah. you wonder why God make you living in this world of sorrow and shame. When you look down the shame, the the unpurposeness that you go through this is what you consider why God make you alive. What is the purpose? What is the driven purpose that Hallelujah. is holding you on to? And Hallelujah. this night you have given me the privilege to tell him thanks. I thank you for your blessing, for your restor for restoring me. I thank him for restoring me, for taking me from place to the other. And I want to glorify Jesus tonight. I give you thanks. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Go ahead. Praise the Lord, church. Hallelujah. Let's praise the Lord. Hallelujah. God has been so, so good to me. When I look back where he has took me from, a mighty, mighty long way. Brethren, I've been praying for something with my daughter for over two years. And out of the blue, God opened the door. When I meant he opened the door for us, I just have to say, thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Just pray my strength and pray for my daughter in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Can we all stand? This is our testimony song. This is it. We're all going to testify this song at this time. Can we all stand? Singers, just get ready. We're, we're not going to leave. Climbing, we're climbing. Moving, we're moving. Moving up the narrow way. Church. Climbing, we're climbing. Moving, we're moving, moving up the narrow way. We might lose some weight, we not lose faith. Climbing up the narrow way. Do a track on up the walk with black up the climbing up the warriors. The road is rough, the road is rocky. Hallelujah, we not sure when we check it. We not backslide, we not buried aside. Heaven hold me up with warriors. I don't have a friend. We now go friends, now have a attack. So when we go up, I'll be a pretty road. We now go Hold on there. Hold on there. Hold on there. This is the last one. Put on your dancing shoes, man. Just three more minutes. Are you ready? Yeah. We say, climbing, we climbing. Oh, we be moving. Oh, we love the narrow way. Climbing, we climbing. Moving, we moving. Moving up the warrior, we might lose some weight, not lose head. Climbing up the narrow way, do what you can up the walk with black carpet. Climbing up the hey, the road is rough, the road is rough. But hallelujah, we now we now got side, we now turn aside. Heaven up, warriors, come back up. 
Jesus, 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 one God, the only God, King of Kings, Lord of Lords, Alpha, Omega, Lord, Savior, Deliverer, the only God, Jesus, 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 Healer, Deliverer, Sweet, 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 Sweet. Give God praise on the house. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And be seated. And be seated. Those who didn't testify over the microphone, would you stand? Because I want everybody to testify. Those who did not testify over the microphone, I want you to stand. Everybody's got to testify tonight. And you're going to repeat after me because I speak the truth and nothing but the truth. I am a child of God. I am blessed of God. He is my yesterday. He is my today. He is my unknown future. I am the head and not the tail. And I bless God for being in his house tonight. Clap your hands and give God praise. Everybody testify. That's what we wanted. You may be seated. You know, I'm the happiest man in the house tonight. My strength is even renewed. I said I'm the happiest man in the house tonight. Clap your hands, holy people. I'm so glad to see you coming out to worship with us the first Sunday night for, for a long time. And I want to thank you for making that special effort. You truly overcome the devil by the word of your testimony. And your testimonies tonight have been inspiring encouraging and God loves your testimony glory to God testimonies must not be confined to the synagogue but wherever you go somebody said I will testify for Jesus here and everywhere I go I will tell it to the people that's why I love him so the Lord richly bless you tonight and before we hear the preacher tonight and God I sent us an anointed man. Give God praise uh, for Minister Sheldon Smith. Yes, yes. And he has two generals with him tonight. God bless you, man. We want to hear you testify. I saw you jumping. Praising God. It must be coming from the heart. Come up here, both of you. My God. Minister Sheldon is an excited, anointed preacher. And if you come with him, you must be anointed. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord, everybody. Hallelujah. Praise God. Tonight, I'd like to testify about the goodness of God. As a victim of a backslider, praise God. God has kept me, and I'm so glad. I used to drive around with guns in my car every day. Praise God, walking out of the house in the presence of God. And I can remember one day going on a robbery downtown, praise God, with my friends. And one of my friends get gunshot in his chest, praise God. And while I was there in the car, praise God, I saw the police jeep coming around, praise God. And I said to myself, it's, this is it now, praise God. I almost give up, praise God. But thanks be to God, hallelujah. I'm in the house of God today, hallelujah. Lifting up the name of Jesus, hallelujah. Who could it be what but Jesus. God, hallelujah. The songwriter say, your grace and mercy have brought me to, hallelujah. I'm living this moment, not because anything good that I've done, but because of the goodness and the mercy of God. And I'm so glad. And I'm a part of the great family of God. God bless you in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God, everybody. 
God has been so good. And I, this is indeed a privilege to stand in the house of the Lord tonight. Praise God. And um, I bless God for all of you. Bishop and um, everyone. Hallelujah, Jesus, for accepting us tonight. We give God praise for that. Um, I have a lot of testimony, but I'm just going to make it quick. Praise God. My brother just said that. Where are we coming from? Jesus. You see, God have a way or to take you from somewhere. From death to life. Hallelujah. From darkness into his marvelous light. God have a way or to take us from somewhere. And all of us, we were there. Not one were not there. All of us were there. I, Aaron, Zara, Benjamin was there. I remember my body couldn't keep cool. I used to love woman. I was promiscuous. I couldn't go a day without having sex. And I remember when the Lord got a hold of me. You see, nothing was wrong with the female. Something was wrong with me. Because there's something inside of me desire more. Yes. And she couldn't satisfy it. There's nothing in this life will truly satisfy you. That's why people move from one woman to a next woman and they give bun. That's why some, some woman move from one man to a next. Because something inside of them desire more. But in this world, nothing can satisfy you in this world. Oh, Jesus. That Desire that you have. Yes. That's why you keep on smoking. That's why you keep on drinking. Yes. And you keep on stealing. Yes. And you, you, every day you want more money. Yes. You want more money, more money, more money. Yes. And you can never satisfy. Yes. But I just remember when I was on the plane. Going away. And I said, Goodbye, Jamaica. Goodbye. And then the Lord, I was on the plane, and then I heard this song God is moving, won't stop until he finds you. And the flight agent came to me and said, You are. Aaron Benjamin, and I said, yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. She said, take your bag from the cabin and come. And when she said, get up, I got up. Everybody stood in the plane looking at me like I'm a drugs dealer. And when I walk come out, a police officer greeted me. And he said, you are Aaron Benjamin? And I said, yes, sir. Are you a member of the JCF? I said, yes, sir. He said, there's an investigation ongoing. And we heard that you're traveling. And we have to take you off the plane. You want me to testify, sir? No. <laughs> Give us <me> some more. <laughs> Praise God. Bishop, I will keep it, but God has been good. There's nothing in this life will truly satisfy you. 
but the Lord. God bless you. I said, testify. You're taking the preacher's place. Take testify. Praise God. The preacher is fine. So, so they. The, the, the officer, the, det the, de the detective came to me and he asked me, um, you are Aaron Benjamin? And I said, yes, sir. And he said, we, we have to arrest you. And I said, for real? And he said, yes. So it was in Montego Bay, Sangsters International Airport. And um, when I went there at the police post, Right, they arrested me and they waited for some other police officers from Kingston. So they came for me and they took me back in Kingston and they locked me up. Right, I spent 15 months in lockup, and that's where. The Lord started to reveal a lot of stuff to me. And I remember one of the prisoners in there, he said, Benji, strong up, man. And he threw the Bible upon me. And I started to read the Bible. I started to cry. The Lord began to show me my sins. I started to cry. I, 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 I began to mourn. I started to mourn over my sin. I began to mourn over my sin. The Bible soak. I've just seen everything, everything that I did wrong. Oh, I mess up. Oh, I was a cheater. Oh, wretched I was. Oh, God Almighty Jesus. And that's where I said, Lord, it's you or nothing. And he kept me in there. I was guilty. Yes. I was guilty. Yes. And the Lord, Perfect. when it was trial time, the Lord stood for me in the court. I said, Lord, I am guilty. I need to be punished. I said, Lord, I am guilty and I need to be punished. But God, just have mercy on me. You just have mercy on me. Just have mercy on me, oh God. I know I don't deserve this. Just have mercy on me. You died for my sins. Oh God, so many times I ran from you. I rebelled against you. God, just have mercy on me. I called my mother and I said, Mommy, don't let me put your life on pause. Don't come back here to look for me. And tell my brothers and my sisters and everybody, don't come back here. Mommy, I found Jesus. Yeah. I'm going to be okay. So even if I go to prison, I will be okay. I found Jesus, mommy. You don't have to come back here. I found Jesus. I will be fine. That's what I said. I said, Lord, I deserve punishment what? I did wrong but, but God but he came in the court but God. he said son Hello. I need you I know you don't deserve it and you know that you don't deserve it but I need you and the Lord used me in there to win souls for him. And then the Lord just said one day to the judge, you are free. Yeah. You are free. 
and I walk out of court way downtown circuit court I walk out when my mother saw me outside my mother couldn't believe it because my mother was looking for me to go back into lock up but God, oh God. Give God praise in the house. Give God praise. Jesus. You are not too far. You are not too far. God just wants a broken and a contrite heart. He will not despise. Just come to him. And he will make you brand new. God bless you. Give God praise in the hour. Give God praise in the hour. I almost feel like making an altar call. Hallelujah. Somebody said he will pick you up. He will turn you around. He will find you wherever you are. For destiny must be fulfilled on your life. Beautiful. 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 Look what God has done. Master mine is he. Nobody leaves here today, tonight, believing that your situation is too difficult for God. For God can. He has done it in the past. We're going to be lifting an offering tonight. I'd like two ushers to come here. Stand before me. Two ushers. I want everybody tonight to give a sacrificial offering. We're going to bless the preachers tonight. Is that all right? I said we're going to bless the preachers, even these two men that spoke to us tonight. Amen? Oh, you get cold on me. We just can't receive and not give. And I want you to take a special offering out, perhaps a thousand dollars. And come, you stand up our hair. You go over there. Don't hug up. Any bucket. Mmm. Look at somebody who was imprisoned in the different circumstances, but you're here tonight and you heard a word. Take that special offering out and bring it. Yes, it might be your last sacrificial given. Mm. Yes. Can't be too small if it is a sacrifice. No. You are <laughs> yeah, bring the 10 cent come. Bring it come. That's what you have. When you come to the house of the Lord, you must bring an offering. Bring your praise. Mmm.
God bless you. You give a sacrificial offering tonight. God's going to open the windows of heaven. And pour blessings on you tomorrow. Yeah. I know there is somebody else who wants to come. Come. Bless you, son. Oh, yeah. In all my life, you have been faithful. In all my life, you have been so, so good. Giving people tonight, we thank you, Lord, for you have blessed us financially, and it's with that we share with you tonight. Let your word not return to your void, but bless them, everyone that gave tonight. Let their cupboards be never empty, and we rebuke the devourer of the fields. For we ask it tonight in Jesus' name. God bless you. Would you stand with me in the house? My God, this is such a refreshing. Such a refreshing. Such a refreshing. God bless you. 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 Always very happy to have Minister Sheldon Smith with us. Tonight is absolutely no exception. And these two men, I could give them membership to this church. Really good to have them tonight. And they have made the preaching easier tonight. So our preacher will not be long, but he's going to preach. Everybody say preach. Everybody point at him and say preach. Preacher, would you come and speak thus at the Lord. Receive him. Um, thank you, Bishop. Break down every idol, cast out every foe. Now wash me, and I shall be whiter than snow. to lift your hands right now in the atmosphere. Hallelujah. The Holy Ghost is moving tonight. Hallelujah. The presence of the Lord is mighty in this place. Hallelujah. Ah, there's a shift in the atmosphere. Hallelujah. Ah, mama. Oh, Jesus. Ah, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Break down every idol. Oh, every phone
every island. I feel the Holy Ghost, I feel the Holy Ghost. God oh, wants me. And I shall be one. One more time, church. One more time, church. We are the worshipers of Break right down, break right down. Break down. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Lord, wash me. Lord, wash me. Lord, wash me. Lord, wash me. Oh. And, and I, I wish I had some worship right here. Shall, shall be whiter than no One more time. One more time. Oh, bring down. Somebody lift up your head. Mama Shakolomo. Hey. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, Lord. I don't care what you're going to. Lord, watch me. And I shall be one. Oh, can somebody lift up your hands? Somebody lift up your hands. Pray down. I feel the Holy Ghost. I feel the Holy Ghost. I feel the Holy Ghost. I come, Lord. I come, Lord. For you to watch me. Somebody worship God. Open up your mouth. Open up your mouth. Somebody testify. Oh, bring down. Mama, shake home. What you have in you? Uh, cast out! Hey, hey, Lord! Now, and I, I feel a move of the Holy Ghost. I want to tell somebody: the altar is open. The altar is open. The altar is open. Pray down. Pray. Yes, Lord. Open up your mouth and give God the worship. Come, let us praise Him. Come, let us praise Him. Come, let us worship. Lord, wash me. Mama Sheko. Hallelujah. Do you hear the testimony? Do you hear the testimony? Shako. The Holy Ghost is in charge. The Holy Ghost is in charge. Say, Lord, watch me. Say, Lord, watch me. 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 Healing is in the place. Deliverance is here. Yes. Uh, show me why. One more time. Pray now. Pray now. Pray now. Help me worship. Somebody help me worship tonight. Holy Ghost.
clap your hands in this worship. Lord, wash me. Somebody say, Lord, wash me. Lord, wash me. Ah, oh, God. Somebody say, Lord, wash me. We overcome this dragon with our testimony. So, Lord, wash me. Oh, God. We get strength when we testify. Oh, God. The devil is mad with us. But, Lord, is there anybody with a praise on their lips? Is there somebody need a talk from God? Lord, wash me. And I. And I. Powerful. That's your powerful. Yes. When your name is called. When your name is called. Somebody have been singing. Prove the doubters wrong. Prove the doubters wrong. Yes, yes, yes. You're still mighty. And strong. It's wrong. So fight this battle for me. Fight this battle for me. Lord, help my heart believe. Help my so I can tell all my friends. So I can tell all, all my, friends my friends that you who have won. You have won again. again. Oh God, one more time, one more time. Let's. Somebody lift up your hands. Somebody lift up your hands. When your name is called. When your name is called. Prove all the doubters. Prove the doubters wrong. Uh, Yours in my team. And strong. And strong. Somebody said fight this battle for me. Fight this battle for me. Oh God. And my own belief. Can tell all my friends. All my friends. You are one. Can, can I invite some of you just to come to the altar right now? In this beautiful atmosphere, we're coming to praise God. The psalmist David says in Psalm 122. 122 I was glad when they say unto me let us come into the house of God I don't know about you but the testify uh, the testimony I revived something in my spirit uh, God is a deliverer oh you don't talk to me church God is a sustainer and that's why I can't play church I got to praise him when I look back over my life and see what he has done for me ah, when I come into the presence of God I got to worship him is there any worship in the house tonight is there any praises in the house tonight is there anybody that loves Jesus tonight there's something happening oh God in Lindsay tonight we are the worshippers oh God almighty somebody worship him Somebody worship him. Somebody worship him. Jesus is here. Jesus is here. Somebody lift up your hands. Somebody lift up your hands. Give God the worship. Ah. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Somebody open up your mouth. Sweet praise. Sweet honor. Holy Ghost. Somebody worship it. Hallelujah. This is undiluted worship. This is undiluted worship. This is undiluted worship. Somebody open up. Praise him till you feel something. Praise him till you feel something. Worship him. Worship him. Somebody get in the victory. Somebody get in the victory.
the victory. Somebody get in the victory. Open up your mouth. Mama, ma, ma, Somebody open up your mouth. I feel something shifting. I feel something shifting. The devil is a liar. Worship God. I was glad when they say unto me, let's go in the house of the Lord. We are the worshipers of Give thanks unto the Lord for all his benefits. We are the worshipers. Make a joyful noise ah, unto the Lord. Somebody give God the glory. Somebody give God the glory. Somebody give God the glory. Make a joyful noise unto the Lord. All ye lands serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with singing. No, he's oh God. That the Lord he is God. Is he that hath made us and not the ourselves? We are his people and the sheep of his pastor. Enter into his gates with thanksgiving and into his courts with praise. Be thankful unto him and bless his name. The Lord is good. Oh God, for the Lord is good. 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 It's mercy everlasting. It's mercy everlasting. And it's true. We are the worshippers. My, my, my. You get up this morning. You have a right to worship him. You breathe this morning. You have a right to worship him. You have oxygen. Oh, open up your mouth. Open up your mouth. Give God the glory. The devil can't touch you. Jesus, praise ye the Lord, praise God in his sanctuary, praise him on the ferments of his power, praise him for his mighty acts, praise him according to his excellent greatness, praise him with a sound and trumpet, praise him upon the high sound and cymbal, praise him upon the harp, praise him upon the loud sound and cymbal, praise him upon the high sound and cymbal, let everything that I pray. tonight you can receive the Holy Ghost deliverance is here miracles is here in this place tonight oh, but until then my heart we go on singing
for somebody. I want you to hold hands to the person. The person hands that you're holding to is a miracle. Mama, the person hand that you're holding to is a miracle. Uh, uh, you just heard just a small piece of testimony tonight. Oh God. You don't hear the full uh, volume of the testimony. You're holding hands to a miracle. Mama, echo. Oh God. You're holding hands to a miracle. But until then. Mama. Yes, 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 yes. My shackle until then. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. I feel God in this place. Sit on me, Jesus. Sit on me, Jesus. Sit on me, Jesus. the music Hallelujah. but until then my heart will hold hands to the person singing yes yes until then yes Diabetes have to dry up tonight. 
deliverance. One more time as the music plays. I need I need the Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost fire, Holy Ghost fire. Mama Shekola Moseka. Uh-huh. I don't know about you tonight. Oh, come bless us now. Hear us now. Ah, my Savior. I come to to me. One more time. Somebody's getting it. Tonight need Jesus. Come, let us worship Him. Is there anybody need Jesus? Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Your family needs Jesus. Your marriage needs Jesus. Your children need Jesus. You need Jesus. Somebody, somebody. Yes. Jesus. The Spirit of the Lord is Yes, Lord. 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 You're getting revived. You're getting revived. You're getting revived. The Lord is reviving you. Oh, Spirit of the Lord is Baba Shekoloba. Yes, Lord. One more time. The Spirit of the Lord is here. Spirit of the Lord is here. Yeah. We're gonna be praying together. Awesome presence. I feel the spirit of reviving. Somebody's spirit have just revived. Somebody's spirit have just been revived. There's a freshening in this place. There's a fresh anointing in this place. Oh God, oh God. Oh God, oh God. Fresh anointing. A prayer, sweet a prayer that calls hold on to somebody. Be from our of care and be be. Sweet hour, sweet hour. Uh, we gotta be praying together. Sweet hour, our prayer. Yes, Lord. From a world of care. A world of care. And 
it's me and me. My father, my father, make all my wants, make all my wants and wishes known. In season of distress, in season of distress. And grief, my soul has all of them found. Really, oh, I know it escape the tempter, tempter stand by the return. Return. Sweet hours of prayer. Pray softly. We're going to pray. Can we pray together? Heavenly Father, we thank you for the testimony. We thank you for your presence. We thank you for your love. Lord, we thank you for everyone that have been revived. Lord Jesus, those that are at the altar, those that are at their seat. Oh God, as we come into a collective worship to praise you, God. Lord, we Jesus, we yield ourselves to you tonight. Lord, we thank you for the move of the Holy Ghost. We thank God that the Holy Ghost is still in charge. Oh, hallelujah. The power of God is still in charge. And Lord God, as we give you, oh God, undiluted worship, remember every soul that is here tonight. Remember every candidate, every individual, every member. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, every battle that we face, every war that we have been in fighting, Lord God, every test, every trials, we put them in your hands right now. And Lord God, we praise you in the hallway. We praise you in the storm. We praise you when our feet is shackled and we are in the midst in the prisons. Lord, we still give you thanks in our sorrows. We still give you praise oh, in our sadness. Lord, we still enthuse even when we are discouraged. Lord God, we pray. Lord Jesus, touch us tonight. Touch us tonight. Let us have testimony upon testimony about the goodness of the Lord. Lord, we appreciate you. Lord, we lift you up. We big you up tonight. It was good. But they say unto us, let us come into the house of the Lord. Let us praise you with everything that we have. Lord, we give you thanks. In Jesus' name. Oh, sweet I, I pray. Oh, sweet I, I pray. Hey, oh. yes. Hallelujah. As you go back to your seats, receive what the Lord has deposited in your spirit tonight. Mm. Hallelujah. Everybody stand at your feet. We never always understand the working of the Spirit of God. But God has various ways of speaking to His people. I trust every single person in this congregation receive a word that will take you through the doors of this church. I pray that the testimonies that you gave will follow you tomorrow and beyond. I pray that the joy of the Lord will be your strength. Hallelujah. Your right hand in the hair. Now unto him that is able to keep you from falling 
and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy. To the only wise God, our Savior, be glory and majesty, dominion and power, both now and forever. Let all the people say, Amen. everybody shout, do it again, Pastor. <laughs> Next week. Everybody shout, do it again, Pastor. God bless you, Reverend uh, Smith. That's a wonderful way of culminating the service tonight. And it's good when we are sensitive to the leading of the Spirit of God. Somebody give God praise in the house. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you. Praise the Lord, everybody. In this atmosphere, can we always stand? We're going to pray for two persons, especially. Ricardo Malcolm and Frankie Otto. Two persons we're going to pray for special. When there is a shift of God, we must put something to it. Frankie Otto, Ricardo Malcolm. I refuse to leave here I refuse to leave you without bringing them before God. Can we all stand? All of our children must be saved. I don't care how far they go. Still help us, God. Oh, not some Mukoshiba Asia. Lindy K. Mukoshi in the Ket Yula Mahashida. Father, under the power of your anointing, we cry for grace. Justice must be served. <laughs> But we say apply your blood <laughs> guilty as charged <laughs> but we say grace and mercy <laughs> Father hear our cry deliver us God <laughs> break the bandage and the chain Set them free, God, from the influence of this world. Call them out of bandage. Restore unto them the joy of their salvation. We believe and we decree that all our children must be saved. We decree it. We prophesy it. We stand on the word of God. We command it done. We call them out of darkness. We call them out of idolatry. We command everything that is not of God to be broken. Let the fire of the Holy Ghost. Somebody say burn. Somebody said, Bird, we go forth with faith, believing, looking to see, walking through that door. Munreba Koseta, Makushe Toraba. Jesus, take the case. Free. Mukareba Koseta. I said, Free. I say free. Flight. Mukreba Koshetorama. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The Lord bless you as you go tonight. Have a wonderful week. I'd like to remind you that on Tuesday night we really have a special empowerment presentation by one of our brothers who's a at law who wants to share some very pertinent information with us that can be very very useful to you or to your family join us on Tuesday night 
in our Bible study slot for that presentation. The Lord bless you and enjoy the week. God bless you, my brothers. Your testimony has been a, a blessing to us tonight. God bless you. God bless you. Go in Jesus' name. But if you didn't want to go, you can stay.